Hello, my name is Emily Trinos. I am my chapter is Hylia Gardens. I'm competing with Hylia Gardens High School, and this is promote and publicize FCCLA with my campaign, Be Resilient, Be Red with the FCCLA campaign. This is my table of contents. If you want to take a second to review, you can do so now. This is my FCCLA planning process summary page template. And later on, I will have a breakdown to discuss and go in through detail of all of my concerns and my responses. And this is the evidence of online project summary submission. And this is identify concerns. When starting the Be Resilient, Be Red with FCCLA campaign, we came across many challenges. Our biggest obstacle had to be the rise of COVID-19 cases in our community. When working on this project, we made sure to follow all COVID safety guidelines. To do so, we involved social media and provided virtual options such as Zoom, Instagram, and Google Teams. With a concern of COVID cases, I was worried with no one participating and FCCLA members not being able to show up for meetings to discuss the Be Resilient, Be Red with FCCLA campaign. Fortunately, following the proper guidelines, most of our members were able to engage physically in these activities. Set a goal. In order to complete this campaign, my goal is to attract new members that are still connected to the family consumer science courses. In my school, we have multiple academies. Most of these academies are FCS classes, meaning the best way to publicize FCCLA at Highly Gardens High School is to directly go to classes and promote. I still wanted to include the virtual aspect. So partnering with my ch chapter officers, we created an HGHS FCCLA Instagram page while constantly making posts and attracting new students to the organization. We also had a goal of 50 students to wear red and represent FCCLA on the day of the campaign. This is my plan, who we are reaching out to students in FCC FCS classes in order to attract me new members by having our current members promote around the school. By wearing red, making posters, creating announcements and delivering presentations at FCS classes. We created this to take part in Florida FCCLA week in November, a Hylia Gardens senior high school. By advocating FCCLA in presentations and by wearing red to raise awareness of FCCLA. Our campaign was completely free and available to all. However, FCCLA members do have national and state dues at 16. We made $16. We made sure to let members know beforehand. The Florida FCCLA webpage included help and examples as part of their virtual fall leadership conference workshops. And after completing the campaign, I'm proud to say that all of our chapter members and officers helped out and made everything run smoothly. I'm happy to say we got 50 more members thanks to our Be Resilient, Be Red campaign. Act. Step one. Talk to our FCCLA sponsor, Ahilia Gardens, which is Chef Shelby. Also, recruit all three Florida FCCLA state officers at our school for more campaigning experience. Step two, form a game plan with the team. Step three, start promoting on Instagram and creating school announcements of the Be Resilient, Be Red campaign. Step four, hold a chapter meeting and talk to members about our Be Red action plan. We have the majority of members wearing red FCCLA polos to represent. Step five, ask teachers in FCS classes if we can do a presentation on FCCLA. Step six, go and do those presentations, split up between me, the state officers, and the chapter officers. Step seven, during our school STEAM night, we had a club table and talked to middle schoolers coming. Follow up, after finish, finishing the campaign, we had over 50 students, we had over 50 students join FCCLA. We created a community service project as well as partnered with our state officers to have our members do constant activities, such as an induction ceremony, breakfast for our new members and cooking competitions. With both new members and veteran members joining FCCLA, we all look forward for the future. I hope to make this campaign an annual tradition for the upcoming members and something to look forward to in order to grow this amazing organization. Evidence of research. So for research, I went through many YouTube videos, the Florida FCCLA website, and we got evidence and we made sure to get all the correct information. Promotion plan description. When planning for the campaign, I decided the best way to attract new members is by exposing them to the material. I got PowerPoints and workshops from the Florida FCCLA website and used that to make an informational PowerPoint presentation while still including evidence and pictures of activities we have done before as a chapter. So aside from the presentations, 
We also had the Red Day Action Plan. As shown with the pictures, we had many members come dressed and ready to answer questions if asked. To add on, we talked to our school's head activity director and we had the announcement. Be resilient, be red with the H-E-H, HDHS FCCLA. Join an amazing leadership organization that helps you network from all over the country and build leadership skills with your peers, as well as traveling all over the states to compete in fun and challenging competitions. We are the family, career, and communities leaders of America. With that announcement playing every day for a week, we had tons of new members following our social media and coming to our culinary classroom to ask us questions. SCCLA Red Day. On SCCLA Red Day, our members wore red to represent this amazing organization. With this activity, we were able to bring in many new members. This group of members stood out in the halls of school, which ended up with people questioning why so many people were wearing red. As seen on this picture, you can see our members studying and reviewing our chapters during class time. SCCLA posters. Another way to promote SCCLA by hanging posters around the school's campus. These posters can catch anyone walking through the hall's attention. Here's another picture of our FCCLA members hanging up posters in front of Chef Shelby's classroom, which is the culinary arts classroom. Evidence of campaign. Here, it's you can see me um, doing a presentation for our early childhood classroom. And it's a reason, be resilient, be read with FCCLA. And then to the right, you can see this was STEAM night where middle schoolers or any other students that were looking forward to coming to our school, they were looking around and looking at our different clubs and different stuff we do at the school. And FCCLA was definitely one of the top ones. Number four, evidence of technology used. This is our social media page on Instagram at HDHS underscore FCCLA. With this Instagram page, we could reach a lot of members virtually, as well as reaching out to, a, to us through direct messages on Instagram if they don't know how to find us physically. Evidence of technology used. Uh, we also did live Q and A's on Zoom for many students that weren't able to come physically to us. So we made sure to send the link through our social media and we helped many students understand what the organization was about. We used the Promethean boards during our FCCLA presentations. There I am again. And uh, the Promethean boards really helped a lot because instead of doing the usual trifold posters like we usually do, every classroom had a Promethean board. So it was easier and more reliable at the moment. We used our social media to promote FCCLA about posting activities, events, competitions, and it helps bring different groups that share the same interests together. And that's pretty much what FCCLA is about in our school. Number five, evidence of public awareness and promotion. So here we have a couple quotes from our Florida FCCLA state officers uh, FCCLA is a great organization with amazing opportunities. I highly encourage members to join a, a taste of what we have to offer. This is Paula Avellanada, which is state pro president elect of 2021 to 2022. And I am proud to say that I'm a state officer for FCCLA. After seven years of membership, FCCLA has brought me so much joy and it has introduced me to all my friends, new and old members. FCCLA is an amazing leadership organization for all. This is from my cruise, our state VP of community service for 2021 to 2022. Number six, relationship to family and consumer sciences. In order to attract future members, we went straight to the source SES classes. Our school has academies specifically within those classes. For example, education, hospitality, and tourism, and arts and entertainment. We went to those classes and presented as shown by the pictures. And this is our bibliography where we got everything done. Thank you so much for following along with our Be Resilient, Be Read with FCCLA campaign.